the Road Warrior Wizards arriving at the arena. That look tells us they are ready to get down to the task at hand. A great view of our broadcast location today, downtown Atlanta. We're all set to bring you today's action. Hello, and thanks for joining us, folks, for this midweek NBA action on 2K Sports. Welcome, everyone, to the broadcast table. Chris Weber to my right, Greg Anthony to my left. I'm Kevin Harlan and David Aldridge on our sideline. And taking a broader look here at the year-over-year -year scoring trend for Lou Williams. And looking at his offensive numbers from the past few years, it seems like teams around the league have kind of figured him out. Uh, he's having to work a lot harder for his points, and they haven't been coming nearly as easily as they used to. And now Washington's starting group. We've got Alex Lynn, Hachimura out there with Bradley Beal. Then there's Russell Westbrook, and it's Neto in at the two-guard spot. And for the Hawks, Bogdan Bogdanovich is out there with Young. Then it's Clint Capella. Then it's Collins. And it's Snell in at the small forward. And as the regular season winds toward the playoffs for those teams in the upper half of the standings, Greg, how much are they looking at seeding and their potential playoff opponent? <laughs> you know, Kevin, guys won't admit to it, but it's human nature to think ahead, to try and map out that route through the brackets. And you get a sense if you played a team three or four times, how you match up, what you do well against them, and what are areas of concern for you. So it's the Wizards now after the miss three from Trey Young. Neto surveying the floor. Lock at six. Pass to Hachimura. It's hauled in by Trey Young. And so Young will bring it up for the Atlanta Hawks. Here's Bogdanovich. That misses off the backboard. So for the Wizards, their last game a loss to Atlanta. Outside Westbrook. Boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. That's on Clint Capella. So quick coming through the lane. I mean, Westbrook really dares the finish to foul him in these situations. It's his first trip to the line. Shooting two. The free throw drops for Russell Westbrook. A guy I view as the ultimate competitor. Westbrook's effort level is second to none, and it lifts his entire team. So after making the first, he goes one for two. And the Hawks with possession. They defeated the Wizards in their last game. And, guys, they, they walked into the arena with a certain kind of swagger, and we really saw it play out on the offensive end. They looked totally in sync. They knew what they wanted to accomplish, and then they went out there and did it. Here's Westbrook following the basket by Trey Young, and Capella sends it back. you got to be careful when Capella is patrolling the area. He, he's an excellent shot blocker. He uses his length well. A nice shot by Young. Young's got his second basket of the game. Young's gotten two of his three shots to go tonight. Westbrook against Young. To the middle. Neto kicks to Len. Five to shoot. Oh, and the dunk by Beal. See, I love how Bill didn't settle for the layup right there. He made sure to finish it with strength. Young outside. There's the dish to Bogdanovich. Kept alive. Kicks it out to Collins. 
And it's Bogdanovich in the corner. Out of bounds. It'll go to the Hawks. A fantastic mobile one block. This one deserves another look. And early in a the game, these sorts of plays really can set the tone. All right, let's catch up with our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. Well, I spoke briefly with Nate McMillan. He believes that Bradley Beal's playmaking is now almost as dangerous as his scoring. Coach said as Beal became the target for defenses, he's adjusted, and now he burns them with the pass. That's why we're going to play him straight up tonight. And that means Beal could get going early and often. Kevin? Okay, David, much appreciated. Now, here is Young. He picked up 36 points in the last one against Washington. And that's for has to keep being aggressive on defense. You see how effective he can be on this end. Nothing soft about the putback there. And why chance it, right? Take the dunk if you've got it. Yeah, guys, but where was the box out? No excuse letting him roam that freely on out the Out of glass. bounds. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by Capella. And how about now a quick check of the league's assist leaders? Here are the real stats, real scores from the real NBA. Russell Westbrook, number one. Second is Trey Young. And these two guys each initiate such tremendous ball movement. It's really fun to watch both of them operate. Now here's Beal. Well, you know that he's going to find a way to get the ball in the basket no matter what D he's faced with. He averages about 31 and a half points a game. Just two to shoot. Well, well, for Snell, a big reason he's on the court is to play defense. Let's provide this team with some stops. Second chance points always hurt. Just not enough effort to block out. Yeah, that's what's frustrating because you did the job defensively to get the stop, and then you gave it right back. Capella with the bucket. And they've scored several times already here in the first quarter on the inside. Wizards trail by three. Westbrook passes to Beal. And there's the call on John Collins. That is his first foul of the game. Young against Westbrook. To the inside, Hachimura. He's forcing things a little bit in this quarter, settling for shots. That he'd be better off passing them. It's been a really tough quarter for him. I mean, he cannot get his shots to drop. They get it back. And he makes the bucket, gets the whistle, and now a three-point play chance here for him. Well, look how Snell dedicates to this uh, selection, absorbs the foul, and still gets the bucket. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. Got to admire what he's been able to do at the free throw line this season. How about over 90%? Shooting a, a remarkably consistent performer. I mean, obviously a premier floor spacer, but you know, one area where Snell has really improved, though, making plays for others. Now, here's Westbrook. He's coming off a 28-point game against Atlanta. Len dishes to Beal. Off target from three-point range. The Hawks leading by six. Yeah, yeah, he's a nice pay raise this summer for Bogdan Bogdanovich. I mean, wings of his skill level, highly valued in today's game. And so it's Beal. He'll bring it up for Washington. Lobbed up there for Westbrook. And he lays in the alley-oop. That's what Westbrook provides his team, a scoring threat on every possession. Hawks have gone just a shade under 50% from the field. Five of 11. And Bogdanovich coming off the largest rookie deal in terms of average annual value in NBA history, that three-year, $27 million deal. Well, after five years playing in the EuroLeague, he was able to negotiate that rookie deal with the Kings and not headed back to Europe anytime soon. No question, he's an NBA player. Wizards trail by four. Yeah. 
inside. Lynn, terrific assist. A nice finish. Solid play all around. Yeah, with Westbrook on the ball, you can't have a hole in your defense. He's too smart to miss it. Lob pass to Capella. Takes the alley-oop pass and dunks it down. Leaping off the ground with such ease. Capella is exceptional with timing. How to finish these alley-oops. Westbrook finds Hachimura. The pass to Neto. Here's Beal. Tries from 10. Another shot. Knocks it loose. And so it looks like Washington will retain possession here. And taking a look here at some numbers for Russell Westbrook. In the second half of this season, he's been nothing short of spectacular. First in assists. Fifth in rebounding. And he's as opportunistic as anybody defensively, ranking among the top 15 league-wide in steals per game. And we're talking about the ultimate competitor here, leading the league in assists, maximizing every possession. He just tears apart a defense. Here's Young following the basket by Russell Westbrook. It's blocked. And now the fast break. Westbrook with the ball over Young. And it goes out of bounds. Last touch by Collins. So for the Hawks, Alinari comes in for John Collins. Lou Williams is subbed in for Trey Young. And a switcher also for Washington. Matthews is checked in. Here's Westbrook. Seven points in the game. Here's Pertinus. The shot goes down and it gets this game back to even. Uh, no basket feels better than a putback. Love getting rewarded for grinding it out on the glass. Williams passes to Capella. 